The very first time, you're going to actually see the violence that sparked a shooting in a high school classroom and hallway nearly two years ago. Two new videos came out during the trial of the accused teen shooter, Timothy Simpkins. Jason Allen live for us at the Tim Curry Criminal Justice Center. And Jason, Simpkins here is saying that that shooting was in self defense. Exactly right, Nicole, that this only happened after he was violently attacked by another student. Now, we have seen some videos in the past of that fight inside the classroom, and we saw, in fact, a brand new perspective of it again today, but also for the first time, the shooting that happened when that fight was over. A security camera inside Mansfield Timberview High School captured students at KS Selby outside an English classroom in October of 2021, asking a girl to shoot video of what was about to happen next. I need help. The video she recorded, shown for the first time Tuesday, shows the fight Selby started with Timothy Simpkins, which students have testified lasted much longer than most fights do. Um, I stopped when the case started stomping on his head. Why did you stop recording at that moment? Because it just got too serious. Witnesses have testified that once teachers stopped the fight, Simpkins pulled a gun from his waistband. That security camera captured teachers who had just come into the room, rushing back out, running for their lives. It also caught Selby stumbling out of the door as Simpkins fired at him. As he made a desperate attempt to escape, Simpkins appears to fire two more shots in his direction. Interpretation of the moment will be key to a jury deciding if Simpkins was defending himself from the fight or if it was an act of attempted murder. Another student, Shania McNeely, was grazed by one of those bullets, telling the jury it happened as she tried to run down the hallway. When I was running, I felt a quick shot. It was really fast. It was just a really fast burn. And then that's when I stopped. But a teacher kept telling me, like, we got to go. We have to go. Zacchaeus Selby was here today, but he was not called as a witness to talk about what happened inside that high school. Simkins' defense team may just have one witness that they call to the stand tomorrow uh, before they rest their case, and this potentially goes to the jury. Nicole? Some intense video there. Jason, thanks for the update from court today. You can keep up with the trial on our CBS Texas YouTube channel. channel. We're going to stream it live for you every day, and we'll continue to follow this trial in every one of our newscasts and on CBSTexas.com.